Hi, Slipper here, and welcome back to the devlog update of the mini golf game. This is the first attempt at using default textures and a one by one meter based building system. The only thing that still is in use is the gold cylinder and the round gold slope by wall. Moving on to the next day. After replacing the grass texture with a checker texture provided by Eggy, I wanted to check whether the Go Cup I created is a viable choice for a Go. And looking at this shot, it seems to work. While testing some collision reactions, I remembered that I did not properly fix the fact that the ball keeps rolling indefinitely. Sadly, I did fix this off screen, so here's what I ended up with so far. We get the ball, get its velocity, every tick. If this velocity is below a certain threshold, 10 for now, we set the velocity to zero. Right, continuing on screen. For some reason, probably because not all actors roll around like the golf ball, there are two different kinds of velocity. Angular velocity, so rolling and turning, maybe? and linear velocity, so I guess the absolute movement. As I was or actually am not sure what these actually mean, I added a check for each and if either is below a certain threshold, we apply the fix I mentioned earlier. As you can see, this still does not seem to be enough, so I raised the values to 1000. And I tried to restrict the possibility of false positives, so I changed the logic to only apply when both linear and angular are below the threshold. This seems to work a lot better. Time to take time off and rest. Coming back next day. As I have shown in devlog number 3, which was finished and uploaded before this one, next I created the GUI. I am skipping the creation of that, because it is literally just putting the things you see in there and implementing the things I already explained in the future. So I will only show what is new. For example this. I added some checks for whether the GUI is visible to the inputs, so in case we open the GUI, we do not want the player to be able to keep playing the game, right? Cool. Apart from that, everything is already explained in number 3. To not totally lose track of progress, I will now end this part and continue with part 4, which will actually take place after number 3. So see you in the next one. It might take a week or a month maybe to be done, so see ya then.